Guess who? Guess what? We're in the game now. <laughs> All right, look, it's time for me to fail again at this game. Okay, so we were going deeper, deeper. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's, well, it's better than the alternatives. Hey, the game ends in 40 minutes. Isn't that 12? So there we go. We're getting to the end of the game. We survived. Nothing to worry about. This game was easy. I see why people play hardcore mode now. It's a dragon. It looks like that. Oh no, I'm getting distracted. Bone shark. He's a bone, he's a shark. Oh no. Bone shark is killing me. <laughs> There's land? Hey. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. I'm just held a tablet. I need a tablet? What's the deal with this game? It just keeps blowing my mind. Suddenly you find futuristic oh, technologies everywhere. I genuinely was not expecting a portion of this game to be on land. This is fake advertising. I want a refund. I didn't want to be on land. Oh, oh, oh. Purple tablet. Reminds me of those head crabs from Half-Life. Yeah. Oh, those are so classic. I love that. I love I love Half-Life. The technology is far beyond anything encountered before by the better. Alien. Oh, please don't tell me there's like aggressive aliens here. I mean, I guess all the fish are alien. But like, you know, xenomorph type aliens. Please tell me this is more like Outer Wilds type things where it's just puzzles. I'm okay with puzzles. I'm not okay with attack aliens. I feel like that's also a trope with aliens. They're either animals that just want to kill, or they're super psionic mind-bending power. Like, it's usually one of those two. Widen your alien parameters, people. Your best. This is really cool. I really like this design. It's kind of like it's not quite the clean aesthetic of like a Tron. Analysis but of the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Further data required. I like that. I like that. I also like, I think it's, I like the reflections on things on this. I believe it's screen, screen space, but it's done very nice. It's kind of subtle. Ooh, cube. Can we just talk about how you should never go into a place, see a glowing cube, and touch it. But that's literally what everyone does in everything. Oh, I should scan- I said I should scan it, but he- He picks it up. Ooh, we found a lost city. Maybe. Or this is a supercomputer. Maybe this is an external hard drive or a super advanced alien species. Like, if they lose all their technology, they have it stored somewhere. That's my guess. So Erica thinks it's a lost city of some sort. Anyone else want to make their bets on what they think this is? Unless you know, then try to lead people off the trail. They're like, this is definitely like a alien bath. Oh, I don't like, I don't like how this room is structured. <laughs> Everything I have learned tells me that this is a bad idea. Ooh. No noticeable artifacting? Okay, good. This is a bad idea. <laughs> what? You know Warning, how to no. infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Device houses energy coolant to uh, 100 megatons nuclear detonation. Is that what that stands for? Uh, which can be channeled through a facility and directed, so it's a gun. It's a big old gun. Do a self-scan. Oh. Self-scan complete. Bacterial infection in your system is progressing. Detecting skin irritation and immune system response. Further data required to identify bacterial strain. Reginald, the machine has to be the one naming these, because these are unknown to humans. So the fact that the machine decided to n name it Reginald <laughs> makes me really happy. <laughs> like... Oxygen. Come on, come on. 40. 30. No! Oh! 
<laughs> oh no, oh no. Get I forget that to attack, you need to use the right click. You hit those things, the spider things. Yeah, no, they're super annoying to hit too. I think it's just also a problem with first person games is that melee is so hard to tell if you're hitting or not. It, it's Excuse me, sir? <laughs> Excuse me, sir? Just decided to walk on land. He evolved immediately. <laughs> but yeah, in any FPS game, just figuring out the distance of some things is just impossible. You just have to swing and hope. Like, kind of be close to whatever you're swinging at. Because yeah, like, you look at your foot, and it's like, I'm swinging right here. I'm not gonna reach the thing. But then it hits. I wonder if a ship slowly starts appearing in the sky. Oh no, wait! That's a weapon! Maybe if the ship's, ship gets close, we're gonna- it's gonna get blown up. Maybe that's what happened to our ship. Please. No! No! <laughs> it's happening! Oh. Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. It's coming from the building? Change course. Set thrusters to full. Yes, that's it. Thank you everyone for watching. Oh, hello there. Oh, they're on me. Oh. Oh. That's such a smart design idea. Having the ship visible from everywhere. Because you know where you are based on the energy signatures on the island's surface. You know where you are based on the ship's position. That's really cool. Oh, you can totally see. Can you see that? You can totally see where the other island is. Play partially translated broadcast. Okay. Nine new biological subjects designated. Mode. Hunting. Analyzing. Uh -oh. Sharing subject locations with other agents. Uh oh. Oh, there's two of them. Okay, so I was looking at a different. I wonder if this is human. This looks more human than the other stuff. Is that what? Is that why I'm dying and I'm getting the sickness? I'm becoming part of the ecosystem. Soon my eye is gonna pop out of its socket and it's gonna become one of those eye fish. Maybe that's why it's called Reginald. That makes sense. Oh, they were messing with this kind of stuff, too. Also, multi-purpose room. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What? What are you? Random. The Va for Margaret. Three Bob the Builder characters each episode for 18 years. That's crazy. Voice acting is one thing that I I would have loved to do. It's one of those things that ever since I discovered that was a thing, you know, when you're a kid. Oh, it's the cartoon, they're real. Or maybe you don't. <laughs> maybe that was just me. This is Altera HQ. This may be your only communications window. We can't send a rescue ship all the way out there, so Aurora, you're just gonna have to meet us halfway. We've uploaded blueprints to the ship's We're computer. Going to sandwich run, you in? Uh, yeah, give me a second. Black box data shows the high security terminal in the captain's quarters is still functional. Becky's but... leaving like in five minutes. All right, well, tell Becky I'll just take the the regular. The regular. Yeah, she'll know what I mean. The code should and be. If she doesn't. Just tell her the regular, dude. Okay. The code. I'm regular, and she's like, "What's the regular? I have to come all the way back up here." The code should be two six seven nine. The regular is just a ham and cheese. Okay, would you just say ham and cheese? Ham and cheese. Okay. Hey man, I mean 90% of what we talk about here is food, so I understand. <laughs> Bloodlight? Bloodlight? New blueprint acquired. Oh! 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 That's terrifying. <laughs> this is a really cool biome. I really like this. Look at, look at these little guys! 
him dancing. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Dolphin man. That's cool. Oh boy. Oh boy. You can see the drag mark. That's really cool. They did a really good job designing this game. Another thing I wonder is, do I have a timer to live? I guess we all do. But because of my infection? I guess we're all about infection. Man does pollute the ocean. Thank you to everyone that stopped by. Hope you enjoyed it. 